Right, folks, so we've just uh, found this ewe. She's, uh, she's delivered two lambs naturally, one there and one there. And Farmer Roger is just about to deliver the third, which was uh, in a little bit more of a difficult situation. It just had its head and she's had to uh, bring two legs forward. And there goes our third little lamb. So, um, is this the first set of triplets out of the new batch, Rog? It is, yeah. Yeah, so our first set of triplets out of our Easter lammers uh, have just been born. So, yeah, absolutely lovely. They're uh, they're about the right size for triplets, even though, uh, would you say, are they early, Roger? Yeah, certainly a week, a week before they should be. Early. Yeah, so they might be a, a week early, but she's obviously had a, a little bit of food because they're not, they're not a bad size by any means. So, um, the first one is the one at the back there, that's up and at them already. And then the one that's a little bit more yellow, it's obviously had a bit more uh, colour in its bag, is the second one. And now she's paying attention to the third, which Roger has just delivered. Um, yeah, yeah, so they need some iodine on the navel. So we'll hang about while Roger gets his um, gets his spray. So I suppose you could say this is the uh, the start of his Easter lambing, really. Like we say, they're a little bit early, these. But we will be expecting now, just as the days go on, we'll probably have... Uh, a little drip feed of lambs start to arrive before the uh, the first of April when we really will start to start to lamb in um, in numbers. So here we go. Right, so Roger's just going to give him a quick spray on the navel. This is just to stop any chance of infection for the lambs passing through the umbilical cord. Very very simple but very important step. You've got to make you sh make sure you do both sides of it. <laughs> That one's just picked up a little bit of uh, a little bit of blood from mum there, so we're just checking it, make sure there's everything's in order. Oops. Oh. Any, way, any debris? He's sticking to me fingers. <laughs> <laughs> tried his best not to uh, spray his own hands. No, I'm not bothered about that. You don't mind? Do you not mind the uh, the stained gel yeah, around? Well, <laughs> there we are, these on. Lovely job, would you say that's a good turnout, Rog? Yeah, Fought first lambs at nice Easter. Yeah, yes. And she's a she's a stellar mum, isn't she? You can tell yeah, already. She's great. What's her bag like? That's the main thing. That's it. So Roger, just checking that um, that there's milk there, that there's no signs of mastitis or anything else wrong in a rudder, and making yeah. sure there's a bit of colostrum. We're there to go. So that is pretty much as good as it gets. She could have, uh, you know, I suppose if she'd had all three on her own, that might have been a, a slightly what you'd call no natural result. But the little, you're better off if it's in a dodgy position. You're better off sometimes just lambing it and gain it, um, gain it out. So there we go. Three lovely little uh, little lambs. You happy with that? Yeah, I'm really happy. yeah. Topping. That'll do me. So from us. Very active. Yeah, so from us here at the farm, myself and farmer Roger and uh, his first set of triplets of Easter. Right. We'll Bye, see you later, everybody. folks. Bye.